stream. Of course, I am once again here with the blurriest camera in the world. Not really. And yeah, it's 10.30 in the night. Let's just start playing Minecraft. I clicked on something on accident. Okay, so. Let's see, what do I want to do? I need to cut down some more trees for wood so that then I can build the next layer of the fence. But I should really make a new axe first. Uh, I only have slabs. I don't have any sticks. Where are the sticks? Oh wait, I have logs right here. And wood. Okay, never mind. Throw that out. Looks like the internet is... My internet connection is agreeing with me. Got a good streaming bit rate for once. more glass and the floor is done now let's put the glass in here and now we just make a crap ton more fences Okay, let's just start with this 49. Hello there, Jacob. Welcome to the channel. Oh, you're not watching anymore, are you? I see that zero viewers. Oh, I just noticed that. Oh, you are watching? Oh, it just updated. Now there's two viewers. Okay, hello there, Jacob. Oh, three now. Yeah, the... My Twitch dashboard is really being a bit slow right now, so... Yeah. Um, let's make you more sticks. Make some more fences. Okay, and that's done now. So this upper part will now just be blocks of wood. Let me place a block of wood. There we go. Okay, and that layer's done now. Just a bunch more to go. 
upgrade some more of that. Let's get some more bookshelves. Place the bookshelves and then break them again for more books. not trading for books anymore, but that is okay. That Prop 4 book looks real nice though. I am definitely going to be getting one of those. Oops. Man, why do the villagers get to sleep before I do? Me sleep. Oh, there's an Enderman over there. Hello there, Enderman. Oh, oh, I'm too far. You don't know that I'm looking at you. I'm too far. Looking straight into your eyes. Hey, don't turn around. Ah, uh, went away. Okay. Sleep time. Okay. Just gonna head down over here. Yeah, that looks pretty good so far. Definitely like how it looks. I'm just going to ignore the items there because I do not need that many gunpowder. Oh, skeleton just died. Okay, for sure now I will need to cut down some more trees for wood. And for whatever reason, every time I need to make a pickaxe, I'm out of cobblestone. Or, no, not a pickaxe, an axe. Okay, that's enough. I should probably put some stuff away. Okay, don't need the dirt for now. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Sorry for any of you that might have been listening with headphones. <laughs> that was a loud sneeze. that axe. So we make a new axe. <laughs> hmm. Back down to one viewer. Almost at the top. There's the top.
hold on, did I ever update the stream title? No, I did not, apparently. Okay, update information. Reload the tab. There we go. What do you mean, dead for life? Gonna have to wait. Actually, if I spend too long away from the trees, then the saplings are gonna despawn. Yeah, I see a bunch of saplings up there already. Oh, more pillagers. The good thing though is that they are now far enough away that Yeah. I'm just going to rain arrows on you. Okay, let's just go milk a cow real quick. Because I still do not feel like I am prepared at all for any kind of raid. Oh, I didn't even get a banner out of that. Oh well. Got saplings though. Saplings are nice. Oh wow, I have seven saplings. Oh wait, no, there is a banner, okay. I did not mean to do that. I guess I'll just hang this up here. I still get in and out. Hello again. I am here to trade more books for emeralds. And then buying lanterns from you. Let's see what you have now. Ooh. Ooh. One emerald for one name tag. I will like that for sure. Where's the name tag guy? Okay, I'm gonna have to actually be up here now. still house iron golems so that means that I have to make this 
at least three tall. Okay, so that's three tall now if you count the roof, which is enough for this floor. So now I just got to figure out how I'm going to build up to the next floor beyond that. And I will also be staying up tonight so that then I can figure out where I'm placing these lanterns. Okay, uh, you still haven't refreshed your trade yet. So the rest of this goes in here for now. Why do I have a bow in here? I don't need any bow. I guess I'll start by making these symmetric. Okay, that looks pretty nice. And I'll also be moving your beds somewhere else. <coughs> Don't quite know where though. Maybe I can have like rooms sticking out of the sides here for villagers. And then one side specifically is like that drop off area that I was talking about in the previous stream. I don't know. Let's start with lanterns here. Because I think the layer up there is already lit up well enough. And then I'm just gonna put torches here for now until I get more lanterns. And I also need to replace that. Unless I do this. There we go. Now it's even again. Yeah, this is definitely lit up well enough. Okay. Oh, I picked up the bow. Still haven't refreshed your trades. Okay, so let's see how I'm going to be getting up to the next floor. I'm definitely going to have it gated off, first of all. I guess I can have like this corner specifically be a ladder area. That can work fine if I do that. Then I can have fences going up to prevent villagers from stepping in. Yeah, that'll work. So this corner here will just be solid so then it can support a ladder. And later on, down the road, it'll be scaffolding instead. There we go. That looks pretty nice. Okay. And then I guess if I really want to, I could just repeat that 
For each corner, have you refreshed your trades yet? No, you have not. Okay, let's grab more wood, and we now make a bunch of ladders. I don't need that many ladders, though. Yeah, 15's good enough. And then let's just make one more layer because I have a lot of wood and nothing else to do with it right now. And then once I finish off with the roof for this layer, I think I will also start working on building whatever drop-off zone that I have in mind because I want to breed these villagers and then have the babies, at least for now, be carried off to an area that I'll eventually use for a iron farm. So obviously the drop-off area is going to have a roof that keeps it completely separate. And it's only going to be tall enough to let at most an iron golem through. And it'll be heavily protected with just whatever I happen to have. Because I, once again, do not like the idea of having some mob just crash its way through. Okay, and now I will go and name you. Okay, so you are Mr. Mender. Let's see. So you are the one that sells the bookshelves, but you also... Prop Foreman. I'll just name you that. Why is there a chicken? Oh, it, it must have been a baby zombie. Well, it's a lonely chicken now. Lonely like me. Okay. Gotta love puns! I'll just put this here. More arrows. That's a lot of skeletons. Okay, so you are Mr. Mender. You are now Prop Foreman. You know what? I think I'll build you some living areas. Actually, if I space this out nice enough, I could actually have maybe just one villager each for each of these little glass areas and I can just repeat it all the way up. Yeah, that'll be cool looking. Okay, so I'll do that. I think there's still going to be enough light. Do I necessarily even need to use full blocks of wood? Because all of this is going to be indoors anyways. I 
I'm just gonna use slabs instead. Oh yeah, I already have a bunch of slabs. I will use oak slabs because I have so many of them. First of all, break my bed so then you don't pick it up, or link to it, I mean. And then I will place this here, place this here, Your workbenches will be there and there. So that's Prop Foreman and Mr. Mender. Okay, that's a nice layout. And then I'll just lay these down. For future villagers. Oh, am I out of slabs? Yep. Oh well, it looks pretty good as, as it is. And I'll just make one emerald block. And I don't know what to do with it now. I guess once I get more of these, I could maybe, like, put them into the corners just for decoration. Something. Where'd the chicken go? The chicken's gone. What happened to the chicken? No. Oh. That's disappointing. Prop foreman. Just to make sure that you are properly linked. So you are awake right now, you will link to that. And you are awake there, so you will link to that. And I sleep. Why do you go to each other's? Okay, Prop Foreman and Mr. Mender. 
You know what? Never mind. <laughs> You'll just, I guess, scramble. You're just gonna mix and match your beds and stuff, I guess. Okay, let's see. What else do I want to do? Oh, the Enderman is still over there. Oh, this is, is it a different Enderman? Probably is. Oh, we got a traitor. Hello there. What are you doing up there? Get down before you hurt yourself. I'm coming over here to meet you. What wares do you have? Ooh, jungle sapling. That'll be nice. I'll gladly buy a jungle sapling from you. Because while I don't have bamboo, I can get a completely different kind of wood. Okay. Got two jungle saplings. So I'll just hold on to those. Let's get the books and trade some more. And just like that, we got the emeralds back. And now we have bookshelves, so we will place these along. Break the bookshelves and get the books back. And my axe broke. Again. Why did I not get any bookshelves from that? And while I'm at it, I will also buy your Prop 4 books. One, two, three, four. There's are some nice books. So once I have an iron farm going, I'm going to make a new set of iron armor and enchant all of it with prop 4. Ooh, very strong. Unlike that creeper. Oh. Wow, that had thorns on it. Wow, oh, I didn't get it though. Wait, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a villager that sells mending as well. I can just put mending on the armor that I currently have. No need to make all all new armor. Okay, Mr. Mender. One, two, three, four. And now I get more emeralds from you. Uh, half a string. I guess I'll buy two more saplings. Don't need paper. Hey, come back here. I wish to purchase your wares. It's dangerous. You should just head down there. I do not mean to hurt you, but... Oh wow, that llama took no damage. Ok, 
Okay, so I now got four jungle saplings. Let's just jump down and let's go plant them. Firstly, though, let's also see how much it costs to enchant these. Okay, so it costs two with there, and eh, I can I can afford it. I have a mob grinder. Actually, let's try applying them separately anyway. Okay, so it's still seven either way. Oh wait, no, it is cheaper this way. Never mind. Four. Mending. Prop four. Mending. Okay, and then I'll just set that to XP farm mode for a while, because I definitely need the XP now if I'm going to rely on mending here. And I need more food too, again. Things are going well, I've got some nice Top four shiny armor with mending. Let's just make some quick bread. Quick bread. Now let's plant the jungle sapling here. This is a nice place for it. Look at that. That looks nice. Nothing? Oh. Should've waited. Hello again. You no longer have anything that I wish to have. OK. 
Okay, looks like there's some mobs up there. Let's release the hatch. Oh, just a couple skeletons. I healed up my armor quick. Escape spider. Get down here. Yeah, armor's definitely looking a lot better now. Come on, spider. Oh, it died. That died too. Wow, my... My helmet is already almost back up to full durability. That was fast. Eh, nothing. Okay. Enchanted armor, I definitely feel a lot more confident about just surviving things in general. So, maybe next dream. I will maybe go treasure hunting again. All I gotta do really is stock up on some food and water breathing potions. Looks like my dog wants out, so I guess this is a good place to end the stream. It's a bit shorter than what I've normally been doing lately, but I've done a lot. I enchanted my armor. I am almost done with the first floor. Avoided a second raid, so... Yeah, just gonna save and quit. Thanks for watching, and as always, until next time.